Tuun Tuun is an Austronesian language originally spoken on Tuun Island in Maluku, Indonesia. Speakers were relocated to Saram due to volcanic activity on Tuun. Tuun Tuun is an Austronesian language originally spoken on Tuun Island in the villages of Mesa, Yafale and Watladen and on Nila Island in the village of Bume. Tian was originally spoken in Mesa, Yafale, Watladen and Bime. Sarua was originally spoken on Wotai, Saifluru, Waru, Jerili, Lesluru and Tirana. Nila was originally spoken on Amit, Kokroman and Kurilele. When the entire population was moved to Waipia on Sarum between 1979–1983 the TNS people arrived in an area where two indigenous languages are spoken, Amahai and Yalahadan. Both languages are highly endangered and respectively had 50 and 1,000 speakers around 1996. Initially there was little direct influence on the Toon community. The original villages were rebuilt as separate quarters in the Waipia area. The quarters are clustered into island groups as an asset to safeguard the traditional alliances between the villages. For the Wheaton-speaking Tian enclaves of Isu and Leani, however, the new location appeared to be a setback. In the original setting on Tian Island both villages were isolated together from the Tian-speaking villages, whereas a strait between Tian Island and Nila Island barred any possible direct influence from the latter. In the new setting the Wheaton enclaves are completely surrounded by Sarua-speaking quarters. In the case of Leani, the speakers of the Sarua dialect Jerili and, Wotai, and the Tian dialect Yefila, live across the street. In the original situation the indigenous languages could be maintained thanks to the straits being natural barriers between the islands, which enabled the southernmost island of Tian to become a linguistic haven for the Tian language and the Wheaton dialect spoken in the villages of Isu and Leani. In the TNS district on Sarum Island, however, the Tian-speaking villages became quarters that were completely surrounded by Sarua-speaking quarters, whereas the Wheaton-speaking quarters besides being surrounded by Sarua-speaking quarters were separated from each other by the Tian-speaking Yefila quarters. Consequently, both the Tian and Wheaton languages were the first to disappear. Due to their strong similarity, Nila and Sarua managed to maintain longer, albeit with strong mutual lexical and grammatical influence. The complex ethno-linguistic scenario as a result of the transmigration towards Masohi makes that Ambanese Malay, the traditional contact language in the region, naturally functions as the vernacular for interethnic communication, pushing the use of the indigenous languages back into the household. In 1996 the elderly in Waipia are looking for academic help to save their language. Compilation of Sarua lexicon starts in the 21 degrees century. In 1998–1999 ethnic and religious riots throughout Indonesia drastically changed the demographic composition of the TNS district. A massive influx of fugitives occurs into the Waipia area from February 1999 to July 2000. These internally displaced persons come from the adjacent districts to Horu, Amahai specifically the city of Masohi, and Tanawel on the south and northwest Sarum, and from the Banda Islands district about 150 km south of Sarum. All fugitives are Christians on the run for the Christian Islamic violence. The fear of Muslim violence, perhaps in combination with a feeling of obligation towards fellow Christians, made the TNS people provide shelter for these refugees. Before their arrival the TNS language already was becoming obsolete in the home, being used only between spouses who were adults at the time of emigration from Tian, Nila and Sarua. In this context in which households are expanded with speakers from other ethnolinguistic regions, the use of the TNS language comes to a complete stand still, each household is said to accommodate one to five refugees. The massive influx of newcomers increases the population with 50%, this stabilizes society and causes starvation. Some decide to return to TNS, nowadays people on the island of Tian speak Bahasa Indonesia. References